You already know that joules is a unit of energy. A candy bar might have 900,000 joules of energy. But in quantum physics, we need to measure energy in a much smaller unit. So we decided to come up with another unit known as the electron volts. One electron volt is equivalent to 1.6 times 10 to the minus 19 joules. This is not an arbitrary number. So how do we come up with this exact number? Imagine we have two metal plates and a cell of one volt. This metal plate is connected to the negative terminal, therefore making it negative. This plate is connected to the positive terminal, making it positive. That's the cathode, and this is the anode. If I put an electron on the negative plate, the electron will naturally be attracted to the positive charge on the opposite plate. The electron will accelerate towards this plate and therefore gain kinetic energy. We can work out exactly how much energy this electron gains using the definition of potential difference. Recall the equation potential difference is energy per unit charge. Rearrange this to get energy as the subject. In this setup right here, the potential difference is just 1 volt, and the charge on an electron is always 1.6 times 10 to the minus 19 coulombs. This calculation gives an energy of 1.6 times 10 to the minus 19 joules. This is the amount of kinetic energy that this electron gains as it reaches the other side. By definition, one electron volt is the amount of energy gained by an electron when it moves across a potential difference of one volt. And that's how we got this conversion here. One electron volt is equal to 1.6 times 10 to the minus 19 joules. To convert from electron volts into joules, you multiply by 1.6 times 10 to the minus 19. And you do the opposite if you want to convert joules into electron volts. You divide by 1.6 times 10 to the minus 19.